Sometimes they call themselves the protesters. They claim themselves the subways for the endless ride from battery to holy bronze on Benzedrine until the noise of wheels and children brought them down, shuddering mouth racks and battered bleak of brain, all drained of brilliance into the real life of Jews. Who sank all night in submarines, bitchbirds, and floated out to sip to the stale beer afternoon in desolate fugazis, listening to the crack of doom on the hydrogen jukebox. Who talked continuously 70 hours from park to pad to bar to Bellevue to museum to the Brooklyn Bridge, a lost battalion of platonic conversationalists jumping down the stoops, off fire escapes, off window sills, off Empire State, out of the moon. Yakety yakking, screaming, vomiting, whispering facts and memories and anecdotes and eyeball kicks and shocks of hospitals and jails and wars, whole intellects disgorged in total recall for seven days and nights with brilliant eyes, meet for the synagogue cast on the pavement, who vanished into nowhere's then New Jersey, leaving a trail of ambiguous pictures of Atlantic City Hall, suffering eastern sweats, and Tangerian bone grindings and migraines of China under junk withdrawal in Newark's bleak furnished room, who wandered around and around at midnight in the railroad yard wondering where to go and went, leaving no broken heart, who lit cigarettes in boxcars, 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 racketing through snow toward lonesome farms in Grandfather Night, who studied Plotinus, Poe, St. John of the Cross, telepathy, and Bob Kabbalah because the cosmos instinctively vibrated at their feet in Kansas, who loaned it to the streets of Idaho seeking visionary Indian angels who were visionary Indian angels, who thought they were only mad when Baltimore gleamed in supernatural ecstasy, who jumped in limousines with a Chinaman of Oklahoma on the impulse of winter, midnight, streetlight, small town, rain, who lounged hungry and lonesome through Houston seeking jazz or sex or soup and followed the brilliant Spaniard to convert.